Alright. Welcome back to the store, my dudes. It is almost a month since I opened this store. At least when it comes to the in-day... Uh, uh, in-game day counter, uh, I should say. Why can I not rename the storage? Hmm. Look at all maxi storage. Anyway, uh, not that it's necessary. But... Um, I could have... Uh, oh, the other buttons don't work. Sorry, I keep getting distracted. Um, but yeah, almost one month has been passed in this game. And I, for one, am loving the heck out of it. So... Um, let's love even more of it. I am going to buy two of everything that I do not have in my shelf right now. Because I know that it's either all gone or that I need more of it. And yes, this will dump straight onto the road. Do I care? Not that much. I will not actually get bottled water because I still have plenty of those. I do not have any cheese. I will get one bag of coffee. Uh, tea I should be good on. Milk I should also be good on. And then it's... Peanut butter. And one of the flour, two of the olive oil, and eggs. Ooh, okay. Come on. Ah, okay, well, that dropped immediately. I could not save the eggs, but that's fine. Uh, let me get through this pile first. Just so we're all good here. Did I buy two cheese? I'm pretty sure I bought two cheese. I could be completely wrong, though. I hope I bought two eggs. No, I only bought one egg, I'm pretty sure. Mm -hmm. uh, that's fine. We always have plenty of egg stuff remaining, though, so... Uh, we also have a plenty of cheese. Yeah, I definitely need more storage space. Uh, you can go back here. You can go on top. You can go in front. And then everything else over here. Slow and steady wins the race, I guess. I got myself coffee, of which I still have one box, so that's perfectly fine. This actually doesn't entirely make sense that if I grab one, it's from the back, but okay, well, that's fine. Don't worry about it, they said. Uh, the pasta. Fill it up. I'm pretty sure I got another pasta. Yeah, there we go. Boom. Then this sugar... ...is still full. That's because I still had a box up there. I kind of hope that... I think I got two boxes of you, so actually... ...I can put one there, and the other one... ...I'll be able to fill the racks with. Why make it myself harder if I don't need to, right? Because I know that I bought doubles. Oh, look, there you go. One out of it. Put it behind there. We're good to go. Uh, I will place you here first as well. And I will fill it with this one. No, the... Well, it didn't make a difference after all. But, you know, these are the tricks that you learn uh, once you get more used to 
the things you have to do. Actually, I can put you up there. I can put you up there. You are going to be used to fill one of those positions with. Uh, but yeah, these are the, the, the tricks that you'll eventually, at some point, get used to. Apparently, I'm an idiot. We all know, don't worry, but, you know, just, just saying, just in case you did not know yet, after all of these episodes, um... That, that, to be honest, that's your bad, you know, not not realizing that I'm an idiot. Um, but, yeah, I already had the other box there, so I can fill these. And this can go behind there, or on top, I guess. This is not filled, but the other box was already put on the shelf here. So, very nice. Um... Do I need more? Yes, I do. Let me see if everything is stocked. No. Okay, so. Definitely rice, salt, milk. Um, everything else should be fully stocked, so... It's perfectly fine. Now. I don't need water bottles, I don't need milk. I got my cheese and eggs. And got my coffee and tea. So that's all good to go. Got all of the flour and stuff as well. So it's only the new stuff. Of which I'm going to buy two boxes of apple juice. Because that actually gets sold quite a bit. One of both of these sodas here. I will just in case also get one of you. If for some reason you get sold a lot now. Two of that milk. I will get another spaghetti, because I only have three boxes of spaghetti. Uh, anything else that I might want to get? Maybe another box of the normal flour. And I think that's going to be it, even though I still need a box of salt. And I also need rice. I'm pretty sure. Uh, I still have eight of that flour, so I am going to take out that flour and I will get a box of rice. Is there anything else that I might have bought that I don't necessarily need? I don't think so, but I'm also not able to get an additional rice in. So I guess it'll have to do. It's all fine, though. I mean, at some point... I'll get more storage capacity. We all know that. Hopefully. But this is... You know, this is what we love to see, you know? Just a lot of products ready to go. Uh, let me drop you off first. Because I think I bought two boxes. Yes, I did. There we go, perfect. And then another apple juice. I don't think I actually have to refill the apple juice. Yes, I do. Whoops. Uh, that one. 32 boxes of apple juice. Okay, maybe I went a little bit overboard with the apple juice. It's going to be fine, don't worry about it. Uh, I did get some additional spaghetti. I did not get the additional flour, okay. So spaghetti, spaghetti, flour. Then we got the salt, of course. And it should be fine. Usually the salt is fine anyway. Uh, and also the rice packets should be, uh, should be doing alright too. Just looking right there. All right. So. 
So, with all of that done, let's start the day. Free up the register, and I assume the first thing that I'm going to buy for tomorrow is going to be rice before I forget it. Uh, and now we have 330 bucks remaining. Very nice. Definitely cannot really complain here. Because every day you have money remaining at the end of all of your purchasing sprees. And th with that being said, I have 300 bucks remaining and all of this storage, you know? Like all of these spare um, supplies, which is absolutely insane. As... Uh, some older people, and uh, definitely not the youth, would go ahead and call it. It's redonkulous. So, yeah, it's uh, a good thing to see. Also, a lovely piece of shopping, my man. 60 bucks, 25. Great start of the day. I'm going to get it closed for now. I'm pretty sure I made sure that all of the prices are what they should be. The rice is still slightly more expensive than the average, which is fine. No one has really complained so far. Uh, neither of the salt, I haven't seen any complaints. So I feel like, you know, I can definitely be more... Oh, shit. I did not see the guy complain about the milk prices, but, you know... It's, uh, yeah, it's not, it's not the best, it's not, yeah, no. It's not what we like to see. I thought I actually changed prices of the things that changed, but apparently I did not. Uh, 250, which is fine, the 2 is fine, and the 250 is fine, okay. Everything else should be good to go. Nice. Uh, hopefully... I didn't get any complaints after the, the fact that I checked the prices. If if someone, you know, if someone bought both the milk and, like, another product and was like, oh, I complain about the prices, it's so expensive, but then bought the other item at, like, the discount that they would have had with the other product, then I would... It's just... Uh, I wouldn't be surprised if that happened, you know. But so far, I haven't seen it. I haven't seen any one complaining just yet, so, yeah, not, uh, not gonna complain about that either. Um, having that said, after this person is done with their shopping, we are back already at 600 bucks, which is absolutely insane, you know? So, uh, just, just saying, money still flowing in. I am a person that definitely cannot complain about the way that business is going right now. Uh, plenty of customers coming in as well. Oh, very nice to see. So let's keep it up. And let's just make more of the tons and tons of dollars that we need. Because maybe, with a little bit of luck, if we, or well, not necessarily luck, but if we're going to be able to make it, um, I can expand my storage today. It all obviously depends on, you know, how much money I'll have remaining at the end of the day and how many supplies I actually need to buy, but, you know, it's a, a nice thing to, to look forward to. And maybe it's not like today, today, maybe it's in the next day. Uh, in like in game, but it's uh, it's gonna be interesting nonetheless. They are going to ding me. They are going to ding me. Oh. Knew it. And you will still be done faster than any of the other people in the other checkout. 800 bucks already. Money just flies in, you know. Let me close my section. Let me... Oh, uh, get some of the delicious pasta. And fill the stocks once more. Not that it's entirely necessary, of course, to keep all of it stocked. But that does save me some 
time at the end of the day. I got a cashier for a reason, right? He still needs to work for his money as well. Uh, I can get... Oh, we actually sold some bread today. Nice. Getting some empty boxes going. At this point, I'm actually quite happy that I bought even more boxes of the stuff that I thought we already would need. A lot of the milk is going to be sold. How much profit am I still making on this milk? 640. That is insane. Love to see it. Uh, that's not too busy in the store. Nah, it'll be fine. Um... Let's get the flour, the chocolate paste, or is it chocolate paste or peanut butter? I keep forgetting what it is. Peanut butter is uh, almost gone. I actually sold a lot of the zap. Today, oh no! Today everyone's buying orange juice. Oh no. The one kind of juice I did not buy. It's like they know. Yeah, let me just make sure that the checkouts are not too overflowy here. Let me help our customers real quick. Those are obviously the most important group of, uh, of the business here. The separate milk packs are slowly running empty. It's not too big of a deal, though. More bread has been sold. Okay. Nice to see. I think I can empty this entire box. No, of course there's one left. Mm -hmm. If you... Okay, ma'am. Please buy a loaf of bread. Damn it. Okay. I guess they're not going to buy a loaf of bread, are they? And there's still one... Coffee remaining, which I assume the lady that just entered the store is going to buy. But that's going to be fine. That is perfectly fine. Yep, the coffee has been sold now. But that's fine, that's fine. And the rice is gone. Um, again, yeah, the milk. Definitely the milk. Again. One pack remaining. I love it when it's like uh, the exact uh, quantity of the, the remaining of uh, the, the remainders of the boxes. But so far, haven't really been that lucky. But we are, however, at 1200 bucks, which, you know, very nice. Like I said, I still have plenty of, uh, of uh, stock remaining, so I might not even need to uh, buy that much tomorrow, which means that the profits tomorrow are going to be absolutely insane. It is like a slight bit of risk, of course, because if the um, if the amounts change of, uh, of of what I bought, of course, then it's going to be a little bit of a of a loss for me. At least you know if the the, the prices have dropped over um, over the course of the night. Uh, but having that said, I mean I can definitely not complain. Everything else that I have is probably going to you know, exchange the amount of uh, profits that I will lose in the other items, so it's not going to be that big of a deal, no matter what happens, I assume. Um, so, yeah, it's uh, it's probably going to be fine. Unless there's going to be a day where everything is, uh, is going to be on sale, but hopefully uh, that is not going to happen soon. But I guess we'll see once this day ends, right? 
I uh, need the other oil. And that one. And then this shelf is done. I don't think I have to restock the milk. I do have to restock a few of the apple juices. Not that many though, but perfectly fine. Um, and then the pasta, of course. Some boxes I have one left, other boxes I only have to take out one. Always interesting to see what uh, is remaining. You'll never know. You'll never know. Still one and a half bucks remaining of the susu powdered sugar. One loaf of bread has to be sold. Perfect. Then the other flour definitely has been sold a little bit. Still have four bags remaining. Perfectly fine. And then the other flour as well. Very nice. I assume the cheese needs to be restocked a little. No, it does not have to be. Okay, interesting. Not a lot of people buying the cheese. Eggs. I'm going to need more of those. And I assume that the salt... Just a few. Good. Alright, so... With the store being closed and as well the delivery service being closed at the end of the day let's see how much profit I made not the highest amount of customers all of them were satisfied though so no one was complaining about the prices which is a good thing I bought a lot of supplies so the profit is not going to be that big um, but yeah the income once again is below a thousand bucks hmm definitely need to Increase the orders here. 80 bucks have been taken out. Peanut butter, spaghetti, milk and oil. Oh god. So much has been going down in price. It is actually a bit disgusting. One dollar profit. One dollar thirty profit. Ugh. Actually disgusting to see. My prices are being caged uh, I, th I think if that's like how you pronounce Pri price gauge price card or price gauge. anyway oil has gone up which is nice to see i don't think that this milk has changed but this one has jesus christ i'm not making money on any of this anymore he says while looking at the milk pack of six that makes him six and a half bucks um but yeah Everything else should still be good to go. Just making sure. You never know if they throw a curveball at you. That's perfectly fine. Alright, what do I need? I definitely need rice. I need another pack of salt. I definitely need eggs. Um, after that... I need the six pack of milk. After that, I need another pack of milk, two boxes of the orange juice, one normal milk, and that's ten already. Um, I am going to get myself some water bottles uh, pasta spaghetti uh, spaghetti two pieces of bread and a normal flour choco pops and I think that's it Pretty much. Choco pops. I might. While we're at it, I can uh, get myself a tea. 
Coffee should be fine. Okay, also get the other flower. I will have it now. Uh, I do have the two flowers, yes. Uh, I think that's going to be fine. And then we have 700 bucks remaining. Even though, before I forget, pay the bills. Pay 21. That's not even close to a month. It's just been three weeks. My bad. I totally lied to you guys. Whoopsie daisies. Uh, you're all still full. Take the other flower, which should be somewhere here. There we go. Uh, Choco Pops, I just moved. Uh, what else is on the road? That's the T. Then there is the bread. Which I think has been fully stocked, right? Yes, okay, good. Two boxes of bread. And the eggs do need to be fixed up a little bit. Not entirely sure if I got two of the eggs, so I will leave that right there for now. Uh, definitely I have to fill up the rice here. I think I got two boxes of rice as well, so I'll also leave you right there. Salt has been completely filled. Yes, okay. So. Salt. Salt. And then over here is the six pack of milk. Going to place you there because I got another six pack of milk. There you go. And then it's time for the spaghetti. Move that to the side, switch them up. Then it is a water bottles. Then it is another bag of rice, which I did indeed get two of. I assume I also have two of the eggs. No, I got three boxes of rice. Okay, well, never mind. That's perfectly fine as well. Don't worry about it. It'll be sold eventually. Uh, how many are still in here? Yeah, it's almost a full box, so I'm not going to uh, be too worried about that one. Uh, then we have the normal pasta. We have the juice box, of which I definitely need to fill some of this here. Let me start the day of the store. And I also got the normal milk, which is all full. And I had one pack remaining. There we go. Uh, anything else that I need, I assume. Up next is definitely going to be eggs. And apart from that, I don't really think... Well, maybe the soda... And I assume, as well, that I will need coffee, the paste, and the oil. That's probably going to be it for now. I'm not going to buy any of it just yet, but I'm just going to leave it there. Starting off the day as well with 500 bucks now instead of 300. With once again a massive uh, stockpile of supplies is uh, is very nice, you know. Still increasing all of the gains. Still.
still far away from obviously being able to pay off all of the, the all of the loans because I probably need like another thousand bucks for that and I just got my loan like refinanced in some kind of way it's obviously not like a perfect refinance but it kind of is a refinance ish kind of maybe um but yeah you know also rude I'm also here with a checkout come on man if none of you is going to me for the checkout, I swear to god. Thank you, sir. Appreciate it. So, lovely amount of groceries. Nice piece of change, just a 40 perfectly. Thank you very much. Must have meant that he bought for 60 bucks, which is, uh, nice. Dude, this, this guy is just a chick magnet, you know? No offense to you, ma'am. You also look great. Don't worry about it. I prefer you over them anyway. And of course, these guys are okay. Well, if you all want to go to him, then it's fine. It's fine. It's it's fine, ma'am. Ugh. I don't think I need to. Oh my god. Okay, the rice is actually going fast. So cannot complain about. Buying an additional box of them. It was just for... I, I just knew that that would happen, you know? I'm such a... Perfect way... Or like a perfect... Salesman that I knew that everyone was uh, going to look for some rice here. Jesus Christ. Okay. This flower is being... Sold like it's absolutely nothing. Prices are fine. Okay, good. Like, everyone is starting to bake or something. It's insane. Is the other flower also doing well? Eh, it's okay. The other flower is doing just fine. Also, there's a line of five, which... It's not necessarily the best, but, you know, they all want him anyway, so it's it's fine. Uh, let me get the pasta. Filled it up. I did not pay attention to the amount of, like, money per transaction here, but... How are you... Why? Okay, thank you, sir. Thank you for putting faith in me. None of these want it. This might be an interesting sale, because that's a lot of items. Oh my god. 62.50? Yeah, I thought it would be more. I guess that's because of the price drop of most of these things. 53 bucks, thank you very much, sir. What the f Are you serious right now? Sir. Yeah, I would look the other way as well if I were you. It's... It's fine. Like, these guys, they like, Come on, dude. Like, this guy gets it. Thank you very much, man. Also just here, trying to make a living. And... Oh, we're actually running low on Cocoa Pops. Uh, okay. Are we running low on more? Oh, Jesus Christ. Oh, yeah, now you want my service. Uh, yeah, perfectly fine. Yeah, totally, totally. It's fine, it's fine, it's fine. I will gladly help you, ma'am. Lots of eggs, love to see it. Nice, healthy diet. Lovely. Uh, need more chocobubs. One second, please. I need to supply the chocobubs for everyone. Thirty-four fifty. Jesus Christ. That's a lot of items. 74! 
Oh my god, that's actually the first time I've seen that big of a purchase, my dude. I love it. The 74 bucks definitely takes the lead for now. Four water bottles? Okay, okay. Very nice. Oh my god. I am selling so much stuff, it's insane. It yeah, is 74 bucks. Then that is like my biggest sale by like what 10% as well. Because before the highest was like 60 something, so yeah, that's absolutely insane. Love to see it. Then I assume that the income today is definitely going to be higher than a thousand. There's no way that it isn't. Well, of course it's higher than a thousand. I started with 500. Oh my god, this is gonna be an amazing day. When it comes to the numbers. Another 61 bucks sale. Love it. Absolutely love it. Almost at 2,000. Jesus Christ. Are we going to end the day with 2,000 bucks? Is it going to happen? Oh, I'm so close, it's insane. I don't think we're gonna make it. I highly doubt that this person is buying for 70 bucks of goods. Just short. Greatly appreciate your clientele. Like this, this has been an insane day. Oh my god. And that with also with a lot of the price reductions, right? Like, this is ridiculous. Also, how much flour did we sell today? Jesus Christ. Love to see it. Love to see it. There's definitely a favorite when it comes to the flour, though, and that is the second type that you unlock yeah, kind of makes sense in some way you know but it kind of feels like higher quality maybe it's that w it would actually be amazing if the position of the flower uh, makes a difference in this game like it uh, being on like a, a top shelf or like a, a higher shelf would uh, make it perceived as a uh, a better product in, in that sense I think that's how it, like, kind of... Uh, yeah, I think that's how it works in supermarkets in real life. Like, they all want the prime real estate, which is on eye height. Um, like, if I would run here, like, this is the area where I want my stuff to be, and especially this. Um, this slot right here. Down below, it would probably be more... Not uh, necessarily, like, the, the budget-friendly or whatever, but, you know, it's... The people who pay less for any kind of commercial or uh, supermarket real estate uh, as um, producers of the uh, the items that would get the least or not least but the lesser preferred spots but then again thinking about that of course you can also make it so that oh well my product is quote unquote like cheaper or like same quality but like more uh, like a better value, I guess, to place it on the bottom because people usually expect there to be, um, like, well, yeah, maybe the, the the cheaper or not necessarily lesser quality products, but I think you know what I mean. Um, and then place your stuff down there so it actually gets picked for that exact reason, you know. Uh, we have sold a lot of stuff. I love it. That's what we love to see, dude. A lot of boxes being put into the uh, garbage can outside, which probably isn't the best place for all of my cardboard, but, you know, the game is not complaining, so I guess I won't be either. 
I would love to see them, you know, like rip up the boxes like they do in the supermarkets as well. It would be so lovely to watch. Like every time we put it out, it's like... <laughs> Absolutely amazing sound effects, I know. I've, uh, I've worked on them for, for years. I'm a professional at this point, if you, if you couldn't tell yet. Also, again, let me close the store. Uh, two more packets of rice. I will need to grab this salt one as well, because it wasn't quite full yet. Uh, and that is going to be it for this day as well. Let's look at the numbers. Day 22, 39 customers, which is tied to my PB, and 1,475, or 1,472 bucks on the dot. $1,000 profit. I think this is definitely the highest profit I've had so far in, uh, in a single day. Absolutely love to see it. And the only thing going up is the apple juice, which I have tons of boxes remaining of. Love to see it. Very nice. Actually, at this point, if I buy the stuff that I have, or that I need, am I going to be able to pay back the bank? No, because I already have to pay back the bank right now. 1500 Yeah, I'm just not going to be able to afford it. Maybe after the next day I can already pay off this loan as well. And then if I can, like, sustain myself for, like, a day or two or something, then... I will have so much money, it is going to be ridiculous. Um, but yeah. Let me buy some of the oils. And let me restock my store. And then I'll... Uh, I'll get ready for the end here. I'm just going to buy... A ton of stuff again. Because I, I need it at this point, you know? Like, I actually need it. It's insane to just think about it, that we're selling this much stuff. Uh, at this point, you know? Uh, I think I only bought one of the coffee. Spaghetti. I bought two boxes of spaghetti. So two boxes and one. The wreck is full. God damn it. Uh, that's what I call uh, stupid. But okay. It really only fits two boxes? Yeah, well, uh, yeah. I guess it does. Okay, well, never mind. Never mind. Oh, whoops. Ah, that's fine. There's only one... One bottle out of it. Uh, choco pasta. Didn't buy two of those. Probably are also had two of those. Ah, oh, god damn it. Okay, hold up. I'm going to do this real quick. Cause that I will not stand. And then you're like, well, you might as well do it with the other oil. No, 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 no. Uh, however, is there anything that I need to fill? Yes, I definitely need a few packs of that sugar. I'll probably will go with... or flour. I'll probably go with three of those. Um, because one is already going to get in there and be full with it. Uh, choco picks, I will probably get to... Salt, I still have... 
Uh, it was also full, so I just looked wrongly at it. Which, you know, kind of makes sense. I already filled it, so why did I even consider it? Um, but yeah, definitely want three of those. I will get two boxes of the Choco Picks. Anything else that I need to just plainly restock? Definitely the six-pack milk. And the Zap Juice. Everything else should be stocked. So, Zap though, I did get myself a box here. So I don't need to buy it because I still have plenty remaining. Uh, but I will go for the six-pack of milk. And the powdered sugar. Um, anything else I need? I'll go for water bottles. Then I'll also go for milk. I will also get an additional flower of those. I will get an additional coffee too. Uh, definitely one of the colas. And it is this one, I'm pretty sure. Uh, I did get the water bottles. I'm almost correct on that. Or not correct on that. I'm almost entirely sure about that. I need more cocoa pigs. Choco picks. Nah, I don't. I still have a full box at this point. No biggie. Uh, water bottles, though. Very nice. Then there is the sugar. It's fully stacked. And I got one left there as well. I got the milk, which I can place one over there, and then this will also be milk, which can be over there, and then this one can be stacked there as well. Then we have the flower of which one box is going to fit there perfectly fine. Then one over here, and then the other one over there as well. And then I have that milk that flower, a coffee, and a soda. I think that that's it. Maybe, like how many are in here? I'll definitely need another cheese. And I don't need another egg, okay. So let's get myself some more cheese as well. Pay the shipping costs. Which is perfectly fine. And then we should be pretty good to go. So, with all of that done, everything being stacked perfectly, or, uh, well, close to perfectly for tomorrow, having plenty of supply, then uh, this is where I am going to call it for the day. Look at this. Lovely storage. Kind of sucks that these still have one of each, but, you know, cannot win them all. But all of the shelves are fully stocked, ready for day number 23, if I'm correct. And then, um, yeah, I hope that you guys are going to be ready for day number 23 as well. But, like I said, we'll start off with a thousand bucks, which is absolutely insane. Um, but that is going to be for the next episode, so I hope you liked this one. If you did, of course, feel free to hit the like button down below and subscribe to not miss any of the future videos, you too, Kashir. And uh, yeah, I'll hope to see you in the next one. And until then, have a great day, my dudes.